WWE has one of the highest TV productions in the world, but mistakes do happen. Who I face, but to tell you... We're lost! Idiot! However, this mistake was made even worse because someone didn't know they were on live TV. Asuka was walking around backstage when she bumped into Matt Riddle. Riddle was talking about scooters, but lost his train of thought. You think scooters are big in Japan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah you think? <laughs> I'm sorry, I forgot what I was saying. That's not what. On SmackDown 2014, 3MB and Hornswoggle were set to take on Los Matadores and El Torito. The three and a half man band were doing an interview before their match and just see what happened. Here's the thing, Pettengill, us and the Matadores, the Matadores and El Toro, all the- Hey man, it's not El Toro, it's El Torito. Why is he doing this all the time? We're supposed to be one take, guys. Oh, you know, just just cut this, just roll it back and everything, you know, and, uh, you know, start it all over. No, 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 Guys, guys, we're, we're live, big man. We can't, we can't stop. You gotta go. <laughs> Get it. Talk to the camera. Guys. This mess up is a classic. In 1995, WWE aired the first in a series of pay-per-views called In Your House. Unfortunately, the debut event had some difficulties. Before the show started, WWE aired a special countdown show where they hyped up the pay-per-view and interviewed some of the wrestlers. Sid Vicious was one of the stars who got interviewed, but someone forgot to tell them they were live. But there are a lot of skeptics that think that perhaps you can't take it, that uh, you can't take the punishment that Diesel will give you tonight. How do you address those skeptics? Well, the st skeptics and all the people I have a little bit of, let me do this again. Oh, it's live, Hal. Sorry. Anybody has any doubt? As it turned out, those skeptics were right. Hulk Hogan might be one of the most famous wrestlers of all time, but even he had whoopsies. In 1989, Hogan and Macho Man Randy Savage were tag team partners, with Miss Elizabeth as their manager. Tension was building in the group, and it finally became too much during a match against Kakeem and Big Boss Man. Miss Elizabeth accidentally got caught in the action, and Hogan carried her to the back. The Hulkster stayed by Elizabeth's side, but didn't realize they were live. Oh, God, thank God. Oh, thank God, that was Tiz on. Thank God. Oh. You count that or something. Oh, Hogan, backwood. In 2000, former WWE Champion Bob Backlund returned to WWE and joined up with Kurt Angle. During an episode of Raw, Angle's doing guest commentary for a match against Chris Jericho and Chris Benoit. Kurt and Bob ended up getting involved and were pretty proud of themselves. They were supposed to celebrate backstage by putting a random guy in the crossface chicken wing. However, here's what actually happened. Who was that guy? Back. They're celebrating, King. Let's do well, it. I know they are. I don't know what they're doing. I, I... Kurt Angle's face says it all. The June 3rd, 2019 episode of Raw kicked off with the commentators talking about what was coming up. One of the big moments was that Brock Lesnar was cashing in his Money in the Bank contract. WWE had a camera in the parking lot waiting for Brock's arrival, but a WWE crew member didn't realize the camera was live and walked into the shot. He realized soon enough he was on TV and quickly got out of the way. After Goldberg made his WWE debut and mowed down The Rock, the Great One decided he needed to get even. The People's Champion got his revenge by mocking and later attacking Goldberg. The master of the jackhammer wasn't going down so easily and started chasing Rocky. I guess Rock wasn't in a hurry because he actually started walking back before pausing and then moving in the right direction. WWE production has gotten really good and nowadays they almost never have any of these issues. However, mistakes sometimes slip through the cracks. Drew McIntyre was the hometown hero at Clash of the Castle in 2022. Unfortunately, Drew's opponent was the undisputed WWE Champion, Roman Reigns. Of course, Roman won. But after the match, bro boxer Tyson Fury came into the ring to help McIntyre to his feet. Drew thought the show was off the air and ended up breaking into singing. This isn't the first time WB has actually shown something to fans they weren't supposed to see. To see moments like that, watch the video on screen.